Hi guys! So today I'm going to do my collection, my Funko collection, and I'm going to start off with Stitch. I got him as a surprise Funko gift. Y'all saw that in a video. Mark got that one for me just because he loves me. And I love Stitch. We watched the video together and I just went crazy. I said, oh my god, I gotta have Stitch, blah blah blah. And then he surprised me and ordered it. So that one's Stitch. Good movie. Great movie. And then next, I'm going to show you Wally. Boring uh, movie. <laughs> no! I'm a big fan of silent movies. Love them to pieces. And this one's pretty much a silent movie. If you don't like silent movies, you probably wouldn't enjoy it. Mark fell asleep about mm, 20 minutes into it. And yeah. I kept waking up and was like, check this out! Check it out! And, mm -mm, wasn't having it. So I don't like anything that doesn't have words in it. <laughs> I loved this movie. I loved Eve. I can't find Eve anywhere. So I'm pretty mad about that. Hopefully I'll find her soon or I yeah. might have to order her online. We'll see. We're going to have to order her. Yeah. Next up is Jon Snow. This one's in the, the snow. Beyond the Wall. Jon Snow in the snow. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all saw that. So this one is edition two. It's the collector's one from Walmart, the Walmart exclusive. The one we just did a giveaway on. I'm a big fan of the Game of Thrones series. My favorite person in the show is probably Khaleesi. Yeah. Um, I'm going to get her pop eventually, but I just don't know which one I want to get yet. I, they have so many different colored dragons. <laughs> I got a new one coming out with like I'm a dress a that looks really good. Really? She's wearing a dress, yeah. Mm, I might have to get that one. We'll, we'll see. see. We'll yeah. see. Next up is Jasmine. I got this for Christmas from my in-laws, and I'm a huge Aladdin fan. I love Aladdin. Unfortunately, they don't have an Aladdin pop yet. Hopefully this will be in series six because Jasmine is a part of series five. So I'm hoping that he'll be in that part. And then they have Jafar so far. So those are the two that they have in series five. Yeah, kind of kind of awkward they didn't bring Aladdin into yeah. the Aladdin series. I think they're just going with princesses, I assume. Maybe. But. Well, Jafar's in it, so maybe it's princesses and villains. Maybe. Because I do own a lot of villains. Yes. <laughs> maybe. Maybe that says something about me. Maybe it does. Alright, next up is my Wizard of Oz collection. I have all of the Wizard of Oz pops except for the Wicked Witch. So I'm going to show you. And that you. stupid monkey. And this, Yeah, I'm not a big, I don't want the monkey. I don't really care <laughs> to have the monkey. I'm not a big fan of it. The monkeys actually terrified me when I was watching the movie as a child. So I, I don't really care to ever get the monkey. Yeah. But these two, um, it's Glinda the Good Witch and Dorothy and Toto. I think they're super cute. They are part of the series two. Next up is Scarecrow, Tin Man, and Cowardly Lion. I got these because they're probably my favorite characters in the movie. I don't really care about all the other people. They just are really fun. They're all goofy and they all have distinct personalities, kind of like I have multiple personalities. So mm, Those are some of the most yeah. detailed pops that they make currently, yeah, especially the, that Cowardly Lion. I would say the Cowardly Lion is awesome i just love all of the detail in him Let's see look at yeah. his beard yeah the detailed sculpt in that is by far one of the best yeah it's awesome so it's so good all right next up is harley quinn with mallet i love batman mark loves batman more than i do but i've <laughs> i've became a become became whatever the I, I, yeah i have grown to like batman from him and our time together so she's super cute and she just looks like she's kind of like I know it all this is a Hot Topic exclusive for some reason she doesn't have her sticker on her box I don't know why they now just recently started putting stickers in the box Did they, they didn't before for some reason Not just like the blackest reason. night Batman doesn't have one either yeah. so. but still she's super cute I don't think they make her or you can't find her she's really difficult Real hard to find, find her now I don't think so. she's online anymore so people she's sold out if you can find her buy her that's right okay next up is Alice in Wonderland. I have Mad Hatter, Cheshire Cat, and Alice. I love Cheshire Cat. It's my favorite character in the whole movie. Well, Mad Hatter too. Those are my two top favorites. But I had to have these because the movie is just one of my favorite childhood movies. I used to watch it constantly and I just love them. They're super cute. I think Mad Hatter is adorable. Mm -hmm. I'm hoping and praying that they'll take my advice and make this Cheshire Cat that's invisible with just his head. We'll see. But they're <laughs> awesome. I'm going to show you my Christmas Pops. I only have two Christmas Pops because I can't find the other ones I want. I want the Misfit Toy and Bumble. Bumble! Yeah, and Santa. Who else is on there? Oh, Hermie. I really want Hermie. I just can't find them. We specifically went out hunting for them over Christmas break, and I never could find them, unfortunately. Hopefully, maybe 
eBay something. We, we found some of Ralphie's dad, but the boxes were just torn up. Yeah, we never found Sheriff Ralphie anywhere. We looked for him, but all we could yeah. find was him in the bunny suit. Yep, yep. Mary Poppins is up next. This movie made me think I was magical as a child. I used to watch it like, I can fly with my umbrella, and I'd have a bag and put all kinds of things in there. Like, I'm so special, I can pull out a, I don't know, anvil out of my purse. Like, Mary Poppins, Poppins could pull out everything out of her magic bag. <laughs> so I had to have it. I love it. I love the show. I used to watch it with my mom and my grandmother. We would just sit around and watch all these old movies together. And it's just, it's a great memory for me. She's adorable. On her hat, she has all of these, like, little berries and flowers and they're so detailed it's just it's the most adorable pop ever well yeah probably up there with 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 all of my adorable pops ever <laughs> i have willie and uncle si uncle si's beer beer yeah <laughs> iced tea or beard what are we talking about <laughs> <It's weird>. <laughs> <laughs> <Review>. <laughs> hey jack For all of y'all that aren't from america duck dynasty is pretty much a family that gets together and they own a big duck calling company, but the show is really funny. So I had to have the pops, and these pops are Uncle Si's beard in the pop is tea stained. He always carries around this big green cup, and it's pretty much nasty looking, <laughs> and his beard is nasty looking. And the pop captures every bit of that. They have a Books a Million exclusive for Uncle Si, but it's basically just his hat that says Duck Commander on it. So I, I think I'm okay with just having the pop that I have. And then Willie always wears this red bandana in the show, and they have the American flag bandana on him. And it's actually fairly detailed. The paint job on it is really good. You can see all of the details from the flag on his bandana, so it looks really great. Okay, I have Agnes and Gru from Despicable Me, probably one of my favorite cartoons. I love it. Agnes is my favorite character. She just looks super cute in the pop. She's just this little petite thing that even made her super small, so I love that. And the only thing I wish is she had that big fluffy unicorn, that one where she goes, it's so fluffy! <laughs> I love that. I wish they would have had that on here. And then Gru, he looks great. I wish he would have had more of the, like, the giant zap gun or the freeze gun. And Ooh, that would have been a good idea. Yeah. I think that was really cool, so. And we still have to get the minions. Yeah, we have to get the minions. I haven't really found a minion with a good paint job yet, but both of these have great paint jobs. Gru has his black and gray striped scarf, just like he does in the show. He looks he looks great. They're both great pops. And we'll probably end up getting the, the collect the three set of Minion Glow in the Dark yeah. at Barnes and Noble exclusive. So. Yeah, we haven't found it at Barnes and Noble yet. We've been hunting for it. We just haven't found it. So hopefully our Barnes and Noble will get restocked on their pops. They've been pretty much picked clean the past few weeks, and I think that's just because of the holidays.